Hey everybody, Olga Safari here to show you how to get interview ready makeup looks with our professional makeup artist, Denise. Let's go check it out. Again, we're gonna wanna use something that's kind of in the neutral category. Um, you don't wanna go with something that's too red, you don't wanna go with something that's too pink, um, especially with your, your complexion, you've got this nice, warm, beautiful tone. So we're gonna use something that, that this particular color, this is called Band Red from NARS. Um, but there's colors like this that are all over the market. Um, you can get them at CVS or through L'Oreal. L'Oreal has some great colors for lips. Uh, but this one is the one that I like the best, and it's just this really pretty, um, kind of a warm, neutrally red type color. But it's not a bright fire engine red. That's really important. It's not appropriate for a work interview. This is the kind of thing that, that you want to use this more neutrally color. Um, it's really flattering on a lot of skin tones. It looks a little dark, but it's actually got a nice sheen to it. Uh, again, we don't want to go too matte. You don't want to go with something that's really sparkly. We're wanting something that's kind of in between that's got a satin or a velvet finish. So I work in the center. And then as I start getting down towards the lip line, then I take a little bit more time so that the lip line becomes more defined. You can use a lip liner if you're going for something that needs a long wear, but for an interview, not necessarily ne needed. Open just a little bit. You want to make sure you get all the way into the corners of the lip. What I want you to do is I want you to press. Don't roll. If you just press, then it transfers the color from the bottom, so that way you don't have too much color on the bottom, and it's already a blot. That's perfect. Just a nice press. But if you roll back and forth, then you run the risk of going up and over your, your lip line with your color, and then that's harder to correct. See? So we've already got a nice transfer, which transfers some of the color. And again, I work on the center and then I work my way out. We're just following the natural lip line. We're not gonna overdraw, we're not gonna underdraw. Obviously, if you have a smaller lip, then you're gonna give yourself a little bit of a cupid's bow. That's this little dip right here. Uh, you wanna just get, you wanna uh, use your, your lip color to go just a little higher to give you some definition. But we've got this beautiful lip shape already, so we're just gonna follow right along the line. So that was our interview ready look with Denise. Remember, keep it natural.